I'm in the mood for a chicken sandwich, but not any old chicken sandwich. I'm going to make it with this delicious Bannockburn free range chicken. And I'm going to start by poaching it. I've got a stock pot on with enough water just to cover the chicken. Just drop that in. I've got some vegetables, just some onion, carrot, celery, just roughly chopped into the pot. A few peppercorns and some herbs, bay leaf, thyme, whatever you've got on hand. And then all I need to do is bring this up to the boil, put it back to a simmer for 20 minutes and then take it off the heat and let it sit in the liquid for 45 minutes. Then I can take it out. Once it's cool enough to handle, I'll shred it, shred the meat from the bone. What's beautiful about poaching this chicken, not only do I get a beautiful sandwich, but I also get the benefit of some delicious homemade stock that I can use for other things throughout the week. Now here's my cooked chicken. And you can see I've shredded it from the, from the bone. What I get when I poach the chicken in this way is beautiful, tender flesh. So now I'm going to start by making it a mayonnaise. I'm going to use yolk of two free range eggs. tablespoon of Dijon mustard, about two tablespoons of white wine vinegar, a pinch of salt, some pepper, and I'll just mix this together well. Now with the engine still running, I'm just going to drizzle about a cup of oil to make a mayonnaise. And there it is, nice and thick. I'm just going to add a dash of water to this just to get the right consistency. I don't want it to be too gluggy. into my bowl and now for the rest of the ingredients. Bunch of spring onions, finely chopped, spring onion in with our chicken. some dill. I've got a bunch of dill that I've picked and washed and spun dry. Just going to chop that. Mix the dill. And finally the mayonnaise. Add about half of it to start. You can add more if it's if it's needed. And give it a really good mix around. More seasoning, lots of salt, lots of pepper. And I'll give it another dash of white wine vinegar. The mix is ready, so I just need to peel and slice some cucumber. Okay, now 
to assemble. You need a generous amount of chicken mix. You don't need any butter or anything, there's lots of mayonnaise in there. And tons of flavour. Cucumber, a bit more salt, and some nice peppery rocket leaves. And that's what I call delicious. <laughs>